Zechariah 2. I lifted up my eyes again and looked, and behold, a man with a measuring line in his hand. Then said I, Whither do you go? And he said unto me, To measure at Yerushalayim, to see what is the breadth thereof, and what is the length thereof. And behold, the angel that talked with me went forth, and another angel went out to meet him, and said unto him, Run, speak to this young man, saying, Yerushalayim shall be inhabited as towns without walls, for the multitude of men and cattle therein. For I, says Yahuwah, will be unto her a wall of fire round about, and will be the glory in the midst of her. Alas, alas, come forth and flee from the land of the north, says Yahuwah, for I have spread you abroad as the four winds of the heavens, says Yahuwah. Deliver yourself, O Sion, that dwell with the daughters of Babel. For thus says Yahuwah Sevaoth, After the glory has he sent me unto the nations which spoiled you. For he that touches you touches the apple of his eye. For behold, I will shake eth my hand upon them, and they shall be a spoil to their servants. And ye shall know that Yahuwah Sevaoth has sent me. Sing and rejoice, O daughter of Sion, for lo, I come, and I will dwell in the midst of you, says Yahuwah. And many nations shall be joined to El Yahuwah in that day, and shall be my people. And I will dwell in the midst of you, and you shall know that Yahuwah Sevaoth has sent me unto you. And Yahuwah shall inherit at Yahudah his portion in the holy land, and shall choose Yerushalayim again. Be silent, O all flesh, before Yahuwah, for he is raised up out of his holy habitation. <laughs>